Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to show you what I fabbed up last night. So I made a range extender from an old range extender I had that'll fit this new remote control. And today I want to see if it actually extends the range. So this is our practical test. Let's give her a shot. So, with this, before the range extender, I can get out, I get up about 300 meters and out about a good 1600 before I started having any disturbances whatsoever. And then at about 1800, I'd start getting sporadic uh, issues. And at about 2,000, I'd have some hard losses where it would have to return it. I've gotten out as far as uh, 2,100 meters, but we're just going to have to see what it is willing to do today. I just want to see if this actually does extend the range and make it more directional. We will uh, we'll soon be finding out. This is a, a Portland Community College campus here and a big neighborhood out here. So far, it seems to be doing really well. We're cruising real fast, actually. About 10 meters a second and three meters climbing. It's a good speed. I'm sure it's gonna eat up a lot of battery. So with the original Maverick Mini, I could get out about 600 meters at this height before I started getting signal loss. And the range extenders would sometimes get me out to 700 meters, but it was kind of inconsistent and choppy. Haven't had any issues with the Mavic Mini 2 until we get above 1600 meters. So we're starting to approach that. We're thousand feet high 335 meters we're out 1200 right now and we're just ticking along 1300 meters out fourteen hundred meters out. All right, so 1,600 meters. So this is traditionally my most uh, the range in which I can have good control at at 1,600 meters. You can see what we got here. Let's see. Let's get you. So the zoom does all that. that nice, I like that zoom feature, that's really nice. But, let's continue heading out and see. As you can see, I still have really good control at 1600 meters out. That's basically a mile, guys. So let's just keep on trucking and see how far out we can get. So, 1,800 meters, so without the antenna extender, this was about the maximum semi-reliable range I could get out of it, but I would normally have some, uh, some glitches, and I'm not getting any, oh, there was like a frame glitch right there for a second. Okay. 
So we had a friend glitch at 1900 meters. That's not bad. Let's keep on rolling. Let's see what it does. So right now we're at a mile and a quarter out. Let's get it up to 2100 meters. Okay, let's see what we got here. Let's see how good the control is. Well, my control's remarkably good. This to me is a, a definite uh, improvement over what I was seeing without the range extenders. So, let's keep on cruising out. Let's see how far it'll let us go. The control's better too. I haven't lost signal once and we are, we're out quite a ways. Man, it's showing full signal when it just swapped over too. That is really impressive. Let's go to 2350. Okay, I'm starting to see a glitch here. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I maybe I overstated. I Man, I still have really good control. Yeah, I still have really good control. Let's see. Our picture quality is like, or we, man, our picture quality is still top notch. We're getting good signal delivered to the remote. All right, that's super impressive, guys. So 1,600 meters, 1,700 meters is a mile, and now we're at 2,400 out and 1,000 feet up. Is that little red thing out there? 2,500 meters. So we're more than a mile and a half out right now. 2,600 meters. Man, I, I can't say strongly enough. I mean, Man, this range extender is really extending this range. I've never been anywhere close to this far out. In this urban area, anyway. And I'm... It still says I have four bars. Which is pretty amazing. Let's see if we can get 3,000 out of it, maybe. Oh... I noticed a few frames lost there, but... Man... Oh, I'm not going to bring you back quite yet. Oh, stop it. I don't want to bring you back yet. I'll bring you back in a minute. All right. Let's see if I can get 3,000 meters, and then I'll bring her back. All right. 3,010 meters. Man, I still have excellent control over this thing. This thing... <laughs> I, I did not think that the range extender I made would uh, have improved it this much, guys. But you're seeing it firsthand. Um, man, like I said, before 1,800 meters was the most kind of reliable, but I was getting a lot of frame loss at that kind of distance. Sometimes I could get it up to 2,000, 2,100 meters out before uh, it would lose signal completely and it'd do its automatic return to home. Um, and then, you know, I'd regain some image quality around 1,700, 1,800 meters as it was coming in closer. But getting out 3,000 meters, that is super, super impressive. That is, that's pushing two miles out, guys. And that means these range extenders really are working well. I am going to add a link to these, uh, to the STL file. All it is is a, a mild steel. 
Uh, you can use a coat hanger, cut them down. Um, you'll need 10 pieces, about 15, uh, 15 millimeters long. And you'll need two pieces, about 25, 30 millimeters long, that are the very bottom ones that go underneath this. But man, this the range on that is... I had no idea it would be... I mean, look at that. We're coming back. I got more than 800 meters more out of it. And I still didn't lose signal, but I'm coming back because of battery. Um, that is super, super impressive, guys. I'm, I'm super impressed with that. Let's just get us home, but man, that is a... It's a definite win. These range extenders really do work, and they work well. You can see some of my other videos where I've taken it out. I got one that doesn't have any sound or commentary that I got out about 2,000 meters with. Um, and then I have another one with commentary where it was glitching out about 1,800 meters. But nothing has ever been close to getting it out to 3,000 meters like this. And I am just stoked at how well this has gone. <laughs> they don't look like much, but these little range extenders sure do help. Just cruising to home. So this is probably the boring part of the video, guys. Sorry. It's uh, the boring part of flying, too, is getting it all the way back. I could use return to home, but I launched off my porch. And I don't think that's a wise idea. <laughs> Got lost there for a second, guys. I have to go up and over these trees on this church. I'm on the other side. I'm like, where did I go? Oh, and there's the little red tree that signifies home. Should be here and there any second here. And 
I am starting to hear. There she is. So, to answer the question, do these range extenders work? They not only work, they work pretty awesome. So, see you guys.